<laughs> Brothers and sisters, it's gorgeous. The seasons have finally changed. Take a nice deep breath in. Hold. Release. How to become more attractive. That attractive person that you... How to become more attractive. So, some people wake up feeling ugly. Well, welcome to the right place. You're in the right place. Some people wake up feeling no good and vulnerable to the world. Welcome to the right place. You're at the right place in the right moment. Some people wake up feeling like, oh my God, I'm so freaking beautiful. If that's you, welcome to the right place. <laughs> Brothers and sisters, I got to show you a little love. Yeah, that was painted for me. Somebody painted that for me. <laughs> Attraction. What makes a person attractive? How can you make yourself more attractive in this world? Okay? You have to understand that the way you see yourself is going to be the reflection that other people see you. So, things that I have noticed. Now, a lot of people look for self, ex I mean, external acceptance. Are you one of those people that are looking for somebody to accept you outside the realm of <laughs> Facebook? I mean, inside the realm of Facebook? And are you looking for that external acceptance from your parents for your good looks? Well, I'm here to tell you, there's only one person that needs to accept. And this is how you could become much more attractive to other people. Let me tell you, I've seen some very attractive women on the inside that just blew my mind because they were also attractive on the outside, but not the most attractive. I'm just expressing how I feel. Now, if you don't have time, brothers, believe in yourself. This is how you become more attractive. Nobody, nobody ever became poor by giving. Let me state that again. Nobody ever <laughs> became poor by giving. Now, giving. It's better to give than receive, right? It's better to give than receive. That makes a person more attractive. That'll make you more attractive. But also, an attractive in the light of other people. When you can go inside, when you can go inside, deep inside, as within, so without. So if you're feeling good about yourself today, on the inside, people are going to see that. You glow. You will be glowing. You will be glowing in the dark. Now, have you ever been around that one person that you're like, oh my God, I just, I love their, I love their vibration. I, I'm just like attracted to them. I want to be around them all the time. And think about it. Why is it that that one, that one individual you just want to be around? Because do they get off, give off good vibrations? Yeah, they probably do. Why do you want to be around them? Are they funny? <laughs> They're probably funny. Are they... Are they happy-go-lucky skipping around and just doing... Listen, do what makes you happy, okay? Like, if you like to... Like, some people take... Don't take... Another thing. Don't take life... This is how you become more attractive. Do not take life so serious. Why so serious? Why so serious? Don't, don't be so serious about life. I, I'm noticing that... Some people take things way too seriously and take things to heart that are not meant to be taken to heart. For example, okay, there's been times in my life where my sister, I remember this, yeah, this is how much it hurt me. <laughs> I don't care. And I'm, I'm holding this camera like this for a reason. She used to take pictures of me from the side, right? And she used to point out my flaw. She used to go, Oh, look at your nose. Look how it's arched like that. You see the arch and how it goes down? Look at your ugly nose. I'm like, how did it make me feel? It honestly, I didn't really care because I don't care what my sister thinks about me. Never have, never will. She is irrelevant at this point in my life. But the reason why I have come across attractive people and my new fiance, and I love her so much, is because I found my mirror image because she's a goofball, she's funny, she's beautiful, and she's like me, and she accepts herself, herself internally. Now, both of us had a problem, a drinking problem. Now, I'm not going to get too into this, but both of us had a problem with 
uh, excessive use of whether it was alcohol or drugs. Mine was drugs, hers was alcohol. When you are able to kick these habits and see yourself in in the you know, and this is a lot of this is a, a reason why a lot of people drink. Okay, this is a reason why a lot of people use because they don't feel accepted on the outside. They don't feel accepted by other people in the light of looking good. Now, first impressions. I'm not going to even go into first impressions because it's not relevant. <laughs> I just had to say that, first impressions. <laughs> but you have to, again, recognize who are you. Can you even say who you are in a paragraph? I, I know I could easily. <laughs> I could easily tell you who I am in one paragraph. As a matter of fact, I will. I am... A loving individual. I am a happy-go-lucky person. I am smart. I am beautiful. <laughs> I am intelligent. I am the master of my craft, which is arts and craft. I'm a good painter. I'm an artist. And <laughs> this is how you become beautiful in the eyes of others because I accept myself you need to accept yourself. If you are not feeling like you're beautiful, when you wake up, <laughs> okay, I woke up like this. <laughs> no, and actually, I took a shower. But when you wake up and you look at yourself in the mirror and you're just like, <laughs> I look so cute. <laughs> when your hair, shout out to my women. When your hair all, is all messy, you have no makeup on, you may even look like a little bit of a mess. Your, your eyes might be a little puffy because you just woke up and you're getting older. That's self-acceptance. <laughs> that's how you become, when you accept yourself, that's self-acceptance. You're not looking for external acceptance. You don't need a man. You don't need a woman saying, oh, you are so handsome. You are so beautiful. No. You accept yourself. You, f you find it within yourself. You see? When you are able to accept yourself and not worry about what other people think, that makes you so beautiful. When you express yourself, when you are able to express yourself. Oh, look at, there she is. Look at little cute. She expresses herself, this one right here. She was a ballet dancer. <laughs> Say hey, baby. Hi, baby. Say hi, baby. Hi, baby. Say hi, baby. Hi, baby. Baby, do you accept yourself? Look at those beautiful eyes, isn't she so cute? She accepts herself, <laughs> she does. Uh, but that's one of the reasons why I'm so attracted to her. Now at first when I met her, she needed work. But the way I like to look at her is <laughs> she was a, she was, last this time last year I was going through a lot of problems uh, internally and which probably which guarantee it, I was not very attractive to the people that were seeing me from another light which I didn't care because as I'm never I've never really been the person that's cared what people really think about me and that again if you're one of those people that makes you more attractive it makes you mysterious and people often wonder well they scratch their heads wondering why doesn't he care what people think about him or she care? it's because they you guys we accept each other. We accept ourselves for who we are. And that is so important. Raise the vibrations in your life. Raise, raise the frequencies. Think as in, in terms of three, six, nine. Vibration, frequency, energy, energy, vibration, frequency. And yeah, as the great Nikola Tesla once said, you can apply this to every aspect in your life right now, you can apply this into every aspect of your life. Self-acceptance, no ex get a okay, again, so we all try to get the perfect selfies, right? Right. I'm not a huge selfie person. So a lot of times, and I'm gonna tell you right now, <laughs> this is something I actually learned uh, being a YouTuber. It's actually kind of, you don't wanna, nobody should ever look perfect because then you're just putting on a facade right that's right think about it if you are always trying to get that perfect selfie that's not how you always look that's how you looked in the present moment of that time you don't always look like that so if you're always going or <laughs> or and you're just doing the same uh pose 
my brothers, specifically my sisters, don't do that because that's not attractive. I've even noticed um, some people's profiles like, well, this is when I used to look at Facebook. I don't even give a shit about Facebook anymore <laughs> or Instagram, but I probably should because it's a tool and it's actually, that's why I've been marketing my channel. Um, but you'll see some people and they'll have the same photograph <laughs> and they're all, you, when they're with people, they're always got that one side of their face. Or, or this side, or this side, and they always have the same side. Doesn't matter who they're with, they make sure they get the right, the best side of the face. Well, brothers and sisters, both sides of your face pretty much look the same. Maybe not mine, I got scars. <laughs> How did I get this if you're wondering? I was dancing, yes, and I fell on my face. <laughs> True story, but it wasn't my fault. My girlfriend brought me down with her. <laughs> my fiance brought me down. It's not the point though. <laughs> I am not looking for external, um, what am I trying to say? Uh, if anybody's wondering, I just had to throw that out there to make a point. I'm, I don't care what people think about my cut. <laughs> like I was only expressing that in terms of, that was my way of showing you and giving reasons on why don't I don't care if you, I've never I've had this cut on my face now for what like a week now if you've been watching my videos I, just, I don't it doesn't bother me and brothers and sisters this is how you become more attractive to the people outside that are looking at you on the inside or at you personally this is how you become more loved when you are your actual self you're not putting on that facade that fake person that you are pretending to be don't don't do that <laughs> Just be you. I always love that uh, uh, on F Just Friends, that movie Just Friends, and the mom, she's like, be yourself, be yourself, be yourself. He's like, mom! <laughs> it's all Just Friends, great movie. And the point being is be yourself. Because when you are yourself and you work on yourself internally on becoming a more attractive person internally, it reflects on you outside and reflects on how people look at you. With that said, my children, I wanna say blessings. Peace be with you. I wanna give my thanks and praises right now to the universe. And of course, my thanks and praises to God because it's a beautiful day out here. I can feel the seasons changing. And this, my children, my brothers and sisters, is how you become more attractive to other people, and especially to yourself. With that said, believe in yourself. <laughs> Peace. Love. Love is a cure. <laughs>